एवरीवन सो कमिंग टू द फर्स्ट टॉपिक दैट इज़ नेटवर्क हार्डवेयर इन यूनिट वन सो नेटवर्क हार्डवेयर इज नथिंग बट द बेसिक कंप्यूटर हार्डवेयर कॉम्पोनेंट्स दैट आर नीडेड टू सेटअप अ नेटवर्क तो सो फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ़ यू हैव टू सेटअप अ वाई फाई इन योर होम वॉट आर द थिंग्स नीडेड और लेट से इंटरनेट और एनी काइंड ऑफ नेटवर्क इफ़ यू हैव टू सेटअप वॉट आर द हार्डवेयर कॉम्पोनेंट्स दैट आर नीडेड सो फर्स्ट वन इज नेटवर्क केबल्स नेटवर्क केबल्स आर नथिंग बट दे आर द ट्रांसमिशन मीडिया टू ट्रांसफर डेटा फ्राम वन डिवाइस टू अनदर सो वी हैव केबल्स इन आर होम वॉट इज वॉट डू दे डू दे दे ट्रांसफर द डेटा फ्रॉम वन डिवाइस टू अनदर ट्रांसमिशन मीडिया टू ट्रांसफर डेटा आई होप इट इज क्लियर नेक्स्ट इज अ कॉमनली यूज नेटवर्क केबल इज कैटेगरी फाइव केबल विथ आर जे दैट इज फोर्टी फाइव कनेक्टर सो वॉट यू हैव टू रिमेंबर हियर इज नेटवर्क केबल इज कैटेगरी फाइव केबल विथ आर जे विच हैज फोर्टी फाइव कनेक्टर्स ओके नेक्स्ट वन नाउ आफ्टर आफ्टर सेटिंग अप द केबल्स वी सी दी वी नीड टू सेटअप द रूटर्स वॉट आर दीज रूटर्स दे आर अ कनेक्टिंग डिवाइस दट ट्रांसफर डेटा पैकेट्स बिटवीन डिफरेंट कंप्यूटर नेटवर्कस हियर इन नेटवर्क केबल्स दे आर ट्रांसफरिंग डेटा and in routers they are transferring data packets okay they are transferring data packets between different computer networks and they are used to connect a pc okay let's say they are used to connect a pc or an organization's lan to a broadband internet connection okay so what are they used to they are used to connect a pc or organizational's lan to a broadband internet connection okay they are routers next now next is repeaters hubs and switches repeaters hubs and switches so what are these three they connect network devices together so that they can function as a single segment so what do these three do repeaters hubs and switches are three of them they connect network devices together they connect network devices together so that they can function as a single segment to perform as a single segment these three of them work together okay now let's see in detail what is a repeater a repeater receives a signal so what is repeater do it receives a signals and regenerates it before retransmitting so that it can travel longer distances let's understand this clearly so a repeater what does it do it receives a signal okay a repeater receives a signal and regenerates it before retransmitting so before retransmitting it regenerates so that it can travel longer distances to travel longer distances this repeater is used okay now let's see what is a hub a hub is a multi port repeater having several input or output ports so that input at any port is available at every other port okay so we we have seen what is a repeater right so a hub is a multi port repeater multi port repeater Re uh, repeater was a single port right here hub is a multi port repeater having several input output ports so it has lot of several input and output ports so that input at any port is available at every other port so input should be available in uh, every other port that is why it is called a hub okay hub next let's see what is a switch a switch receives data from a port so port is a common word over here okay a switch so what is a switch it receives data this receives data from a port over here it receives from a port it receives data from a port it which uses packet switching to resolve the destination device so which uses packet switching so it switches okay it switches packets to resolve the destination device to resolve the destination device so if it this device is receiving then it will change the des destination device and then forwards the data to the particular destination so where does it uh, forwards it forwards the data to the particular destination it doesn't resolve to the destination device but it forwards to the particular destination okay now next our fourth one is bridges what are these bridges bridges are nothing but a bridge connects two separate ethernet ethernet network segments uh, okay it forward 
it forwards packets from the source network to the destined network okay let's understand this clearly so a bridge is nothing but let's take a normal what is a, what is a bridge normally the bridges that we see on roads okay two things connecting each other so a bridge connect two separate ethernet network segments so two two separate ethernet this is one ethernet this is another ethernet these are both network segments and connecting these two is called a bridge okay what does what does these do it forwards packets from the source network to the destined network so if this is the source network and if this is the destined network then it forwards the packets from here to here that's it i hope it is clear right next one is gateways now gateways is nothing but a gateway connects entirely different networks that work upon different protocols so what is a gateway gateway connects entirely different networks so completely different networks that work upon different protocols which are working on different port protocols that is called a gateway okay it is the entry and the exit of the point in network and controls access to the other network so what what is gateway so with the word we can identify right so what is a gate it is an entry and exit place to any you know college or any home or anything so here also same way it is the entry and exit of the point in network so it is a gate to a network and it controls the access to other networks okay next the last one is network interface cards network interface card is also called as nic nic is nothing but nic is a component of the computer to connect it to a network so nic is a it is a component right it is a component of the computer it is a component of a computer to connect it to a network right network cards are of two types network card are of two types internal network cards and external network cards i hope it is clear thank you